Hey, it's Paul here at Music Villa in Bozeman, Montana, and I am with my friend Paul Reed Smith here. And today, we're, what are we doing today? We don't even know what we're doing. Well, we're, Tyler we Larson's got, here, yeah, and Tyler we're going to do a clinic, and he's very big on the internet. He's a big YouTube guy. And has broken that code yeah. about how to communicate with people yep. uh, on the internet, uh, guitar lesson-wise, and God knows yep. how many other things. And we're going to have an uh, active discussion with your customers. Good. I can't wait. Let me ask you a question. <laughs> yes. How many of the people that are going to watch this video know that this is a destination store, know that your store is full of experts on guitars, know that there's a semi um, old school uh, museum hanging up in the top I, that you I change think your. It's, it's growing, it's getting more and more. People are learning. Um, and hopefully, the more videos like this and the more times you come out, people will want to know why people come here. So. Well, so there there are things they call brick and mortar stores, which means you have an actual building where there are guitars. But yeah. this is more than that. This is a destination store, a place where you want to go in and have an experience and, yeah. and try things and ask questions and try and learn and yeah. all that stuff. And I, I really like that about this place. Um, it's a good hang. It is a good hang. It's a good and hang. it's a good town and it's fun and... Um, I'm glad to be here again. Well, we enjoy having you. Can what I you tell you the yeah. story about this? I'd love to hear it. So I'm friends with this guy named Tim Pierce. Tim is, you know, there used to be 400 active working musicians in L.A., uh, and now right. there's not a lot left, right? right? But he's one of the few a a I mean, completely active um, studio musicians. And he started a YouTuber business teaching people how to play guitar. And I brought a guitar that he really liked. Mm -hmm. And I needed a guitar to bring here right. to do the clinic with, right? So I, I traded him for a minute. Okay. And I took one of his best recording guitars. I plugged this thing upstairs. I was like stunned at how good it sounded. And what happens is this was uh, our signature guitar with the, the beginning of the new pickups and the 408s and all this stuff. And I forgot how good it sounded. And right. I plugged it in and I went... Oh my God! And I, I begged you to come over. You, come with it. You were like, like a. I'm like, I, I'm like you surprised yourself. Well, That's what I was saying. I was like, Paul, you just surprised yourself well, the, with your own the, guitar. Well, which except is cool. that what happens is the markets, they didn't yawn, but it just kind of forgot. They right. said, well, what else you got new? Right. What else you got new? Right. What yeah, else yeah, you yeah. got new? You know. Um, now, did this become the Paul's guitar? Yeah, it's kind pretty, of. Was this kind it's of kind, but it has a Pernambuco or Chaltecoco neck. Um, which is this violin bow wood, uh -huh. and um, it had the beginning of, of the switching system that we use now all yeah. the time. And um, this is ac actually woolly, woolly mammoth ivory inlays, but now the government has said that since we can't really tell the difference between elephant ivory and mammoth ivory, you really can't use mammoth ivory in some states. It's like, right. wait a minute, we're not going to make them extinct. Right. So yeah. we have a replacement now, but I, I would just... Yeah, you were blown away up there. You I plugged like, into that Sonzera like, amp, yeah, by the way, was which like, was amazing. Yeah, I was like, and I was like, how? Oh, and I got to go back and look at the old specs and see what right. it was. But uh, it was fun. And I called Tim and I go, this is a hell of a guitar. He says, Paul, that's a recording monster. You took my guitar. And I was like, that's cool. But that's he cool. likes having new things yeah, yeah, too. Yeah. And I brought him that, I brought a video of a, a new product that we were coming out with, yeah. and he took one of the prototypes of that, and which he really liked. Which are we going to talk about or not? That's under the Look, we're going to redo the entire McCarty line in October, but I really don't want to talk about it because yeah. then, it, 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 yeah. then, you, then you became my complete marketing department. And, <laughs> I, don't, uh, and I don't want to be responsible for that. Well, yeah. Well, we've got good things coming, as you know. You always have good things coming. Mm -hmm. It's really cool. It's you know it's exciting. I mean, you build so many guitars, and mm -hmm. you you you're you're such a guitar guy. And then to see you get excited about something that you built a while back just shows like the passion that you have for guitars. And that's what I love about your guitars, and love about you. And every time we hang out, it's just uh, fun to uh, see someone passionate about guitars and the industry and everything else that goes on in the in the world that so, you're passionate so about. So you know all those guitars you're having on the wall. Yeah. If you pull one down, whatever the people that made that guitar that day, that's what they thought. Yeah. And so they're kind of like portals, you know, yeah, because that's are. what they thought that day, right? Yeah. 
You saw. I one. had forgotten some of the things I thought this day. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Yeah. And you Same. saw one when you walked in today. Yeah. What's the one you want? Oh, me to you bring have it down? to bring it down. It's the Tisco Del Rey yeah. green guitar that I saw in the Sears catalog, and the reason it shocked me when I was a kid is because it had been fretted. It had been fret slotted. It had been radiused. It had a truss rod in it. It had tuning pegs on it. It had a nut. It had pickups. It had a sunburst. It had a finish on the body. It had a bridge. It had strings. It had knobs. It had pots. And I just thought, why don't you just do each one a little bit better and you have a better guitar? Right. I mean, why make it so yeah. it's only 200 bucks? I, so it's a little more money, but you spent more time on each part. And was, you yeah. st- I, the thing that stunned me is you still had to do everything, right? Yeah. And you have to do it all, right? right? Yeah, so, you might as well, yeah. It's, it was just, yeah. why don't you do it better was my thought when, yeah. I, when I saw it in the catalog. And green guitars were the Antichrist until yeah. we started doing yeah. emerald green guitars, and it was okay. Yeah. Um, well, I want colors, you to bring that guitar down when I do the clinic today. I got to tell you, this is my favorite guitar in the store right now. And I think well, it's the you color. You have a credit card. Well, you color. already own it. I, I do get... already own it. <laughs> Problem is, I'm, I can't play. What color worth a is crap. it? So, what do you call that? I think it's slate blue. Slate blue. Yeah, it's beautiful. The whole guitar is beautiful. Mm-hmm. Everything on it, the com- every component of it, everything. So, I just want to just pull it so out. So, why down. don't you have it? I think I might. Maybe I'll take it home and try to practice and become a better guitar player. You are a musician, right? What did you? No, play? I'm a drummer. Yeah, musician. <laughs> that's not. I know. What do you, what do you call somebody who hangs yeah. out with musicians, exactly. drummers? That's yeah. an old yeah. joke. Well, you're a drummer. Hey, I am a drummer. So, but I'm a guitar. How many, how many drum sets do want you want to be? I have about four. But I don't care about drums. I care about guitars. Why don't you? Why don't you get yourself a Brady snare drum? Why don't you? Why don't you like go deep? Why don't you? I mean, you work, you work so I don't hard. Care. I like guitars. I'm going to show you some guitars, by the way. We're we're going to go cruise through. I got some. I'm going to show you guitars. Because I, I went and looked like. in the side room. They weren't there, except you had an old harp See the guitar. stuff on the floor in the cases? I saw the harp right. guitars. I saw the old 1923 yep. Gibsons. We'll, we'll show you. We'll go We'll go see some stuff. Paul, thank you for coming. Um, Can we take your guys out for a drink yeah. tonight afterwards? Let's do it. I, look, I really like your crew. And when if you guys come to the store, you're going to like the crew, too. They're yeah. all Good they people good. and they're got, smart and they've, they've been here a while. And yeah. just, we got great guys here. It's a great vibe and uh, mm-hmm. we appreciate you coming out and uh, we'll do it again soon. But we'll go upstairs and we'll get ready for this thing that we're going to do. So share this video with your friends and tell everybody about this place. Will you guys? Thanks. Thanks, guys.